Hey folks, this is KBS from C or Kenny. And this is my buddy, mother YouTube buddy, my mommy, uh, Guy Brown. How you doing, everybody? And we're doing a video on our hybrid biomass heater that we installed, the stack install, and all that good stuff. This is part two of the hybrid heater series. And then we're going to go back and I'm going to show you the stack install, the inside stack install, and outside, and how we offset it away from the building. All right, here we go, y'all. First of all, this is the stack coming up right here. We, we installed our damper right here. Guy and I and Sniper, oh, excuse me, also Sniper Dave. Can't, I can't leave Sniper Dave out. See, there's Sniper, I mean, his name is Sniper Dave. Yeah, he's a happy guy. Happy, happy. Oh, sorry about that, um, uh, Duck Dynasty. But anyway, and here's the, the damper. Now, we got it open now, but you can close it this way to get it going where we want to. And there it is, it's open. And we also have a, which guy helped me install, is a flu, um, what's it called again? Oh, uh, thermometer, just a the stack, 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 stack of mop. Stack of mop, thermometer. Let's know what the precise heat you got and all that kind of stuff. And this is for it started up. All that good stuff. All right, and here is our stack install. We use collars, uh, self-locking stainless steel collars and everything. And that is class A double wall super vent pipe going through, this, through the wall. Right there. And also we use the heat shield from leftover material we have from the building. Which is going the entire back of the, of the uh, building itself. I mentioned that there's an air gap at the bottom. And we, we also have an air gap. Which guy <laughs> pointed out, we have an air gap here in between a building. So everything can breathe. There's the air gap, y'all. So everything can breathe. And we have plenty of stove pipe to keep everything nice and warm in here. And we'll take the, uh, everything, everything is screwed. The stacks are screwed, stove pipe is screwed. So that way, you know, everything will stay together. In good shape, three screws on, on all the way around. And also here's a fan we'll be using the heat with. Plus the, the uh, fan right here uh, that we're going to plug in the uh, squirrel cage fan. The air, air blower right here. Alright, and this is the part two series on this video. But here's the vat. I cleaned it out. Got all the junk, oil, and everything out of it. And now let's go back and see. Let's go outside and see the stack install, y'all. All right, come on here, guy and Sniper Dave. Sniper Dave and I and uh, uh, Mr. Guy Brown. Mr. Guy Brown or just Guy Brown? Yes, yeah, either or. Either or. He has a YouTube channel also, fellow YouTube buddy, for years. Going on over a year now, right? Oh, uh, well, yes, sir. A year. Just about a year. But here's our standoff we made. We made that a uh, 3 16 angle iron. That way it would be completely stout and tough and here's our thimble coming through here and don't fall down sniper dave over there and here is our stack coming up and it's going and it's going and it's actually two and a half feet above what we need actually it's, 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 i think you're about, actually a, a little over three foot above. a little over three feet above the cap so we get plenty of draft uh, typical installation would require two foot above anything ten feet around exactly and we're well above that and we also have locking bands on everything you have to see here. Locking bands is installed on everything. So it's definitely well approved. Uh, clean out right here at the bottom of the sea. That's a clean out. You just unscrew it, screw it off later on after you get everything going. And there's how we got installed, y'all. And right here, if I come over here, you can see how we offset it away from the building. So we wouldn't have to cut a hole through our overhang or eave. That's protect is that the correct word there, guy? Uh Eve, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Eve, yeah. And there she is. And the wind is blowing today. Good. So we're getting ready to crank it up in the next video and we'll let you see how it works. And there's my easy AT antenna we had on the, one of the other videos. But Anyway, y'all, make this one kind of short. 
All right, now we got a old Mr. Guy Brown and Sniper Dave and all of us in here. Come on over here. We get everybody yeah. a cheese. <laughs> yes. Anyway, two days of hard work. Eh? This is this is Kenny Guy Brown. Is this his YouTube channel? KBSMC is my channel. And y'all come on and uh, watch our videos, and we'll show you how to do some more heating prod um, projects. Y'all take it easy now. All right. Bye bye. Let's see if I can get this thing shut off. There you go.